Tua, Tua, I'm just playing, man, what is up guys, bring you guys some gameplay here with the Miami Dolphins once again, getting matched up with the Arizona Cardinals, and boy oh boy, Ryan Fitzpatrick, I'm sure if you guys are around social media and follow certain NFL pages or just in general, know a lot of stuff about the NFL, well, I'm sure you're aware that Tua Tagovailoa, Tagovailoa, if I pronounce it wrong, my apologies, has earned a starting job and um, honestly it did come to a shock to me and personally when I found out I was laying in my bed and, and in my phone ding, ding, ding. you guys if you guys have an iPhone you guys know what I'm talking about Tua got the starting job and right here I find Isaiah Ford so this is a gameplay video not just a discussion video based on Tua but honestly I'm just happy because I don't know if Tua could be the next franchise quarterback for Miami I hope he is trust me guys when it when it comes to me and the Dolphins I'm a really big fan I support them a lot I've been supporting them for a long time and I'm just so excited but anyways I like to hear you guys opinion on the situation do you feel as if Ryan Fitzpatrick got he, he was did wrong or do you think that Tua needs to get started now to start developing as a quarterback right I mean at a fifth overall pick you would want high expectations, right? No pressure, but you still expect high expectations. And right here, Christian Wilkins gets a sack. Right there, doing a little bit of the Mike Tyson moves. But yeah, so let me know your guys' opinion. Honestly, I think it's a great move, but I see a lot of these pages, a lot of these news analysts talking about how this is a bad move. I mean, Tua, he didn't have to play right now. He could get fully healed. Which then again, we don't know what's going on from the inside. We're only speaking on from the outside, right? We don't know if Tua is fully recovered. We don't know if maybe Tua told Brian Flores that, hey, I feel good. I'm ready. Let's do this. Let's rock and roll. Who knows, right? So we're only speaking from the outside. And once again, I do feel bad for Ryan Fitzpatrick. But again, it's the NFL. And right here, I ended up throwing an interception. But yeah, so it's the NFL. So we all know that. In the NFL, I remember I was watching a, a little bit of a broadcast or something like that. It's saying not for long. And it's true. You're not going to be in the NFL for long. Now, 15 years or 20 years is a long time. But in retrospective, if you really think about it, your time is going to come up, right? Especially when you get, get pounded left and right. Just completely getting hit by these 200-pound players flying at you like a missile. It's just not meant to be longevity. Now, you look at players like Tom Brady, you look at players like Phillip Rivers, Eli Manning. Well, Eli Manning retired, of course, but those players protected themselves. Even though they have injuries in their careers, they you guys see them when they're about to get hit. They slide. They know what's best for themselves and their body. But anyways, I was getting a little bit of off topic there. I hope that Tua does good. Honestly, I'm fully invested in him. I can't wait till next week. We have a bye week this week, so a really good time and opportunity for Tua to catch his a little bit of of a break and make sure he's prepared but uh, once again i'm gonna go ahead and ask let me know your guys opinion i really want to hear this honestly it's just mixed conversations everywhere it's good and bad and if you guys are enjoying this video go ahead and give this video a like comment and subscribe but let's get back into this gameplay once again kyler murray gets sacked emmanuel gets the sack and honestly i'm just so happy to have tua and check out this throw Devonte parker Tua connects to Devontae Parker for the first touchdown. And you know what? I wish this game was longer because I don't know why. Players always seem to quit after I get something going. Honestly, it's only second quarter. It could have been a lot more longer and definitely more interesting. But I hope everyone enjoyed this video. Thank you guys very much for watching up to this point. And as always, peace out and have a great day.